Hello fellow paddlers, how are you doing? Recently on Facebook somebody had posted a video and somebody actually sent it to me as well of a chap who had waxed his paddles and it prevented water sticking to the paddles which I thought was a great idea, it was something I'd contemplated I'd actually contemplated another idea which I'm going to try today and he'd waxed his paddles and it stopped water sticking to them and consequently stopped water splashing into the boat and I thought, that's a great idea he had this nice block of wax. I don't have anything so fancy, but what I do have is, I've got some tea lights, and I figure if I take, because the wick of these comes out really easy, isn't this just a block of wax? So I'm gonna try that on one paddle. I've got four paddles here, and then I've also got a box of candles and I thought well will any old candle do? Stay. And then I also thought there's another fluid, well a spray, that many of us have at home. It might be ideal as a quick solution to this and uh, so I thought it was worth a try, it's worth giving a go. Let's just try one of the paddles just dipped in the water and see how much water it holds. As you can see quite a lot of water dripping off that. So I'm going to use, I'm going to try these tea lights. You might have seen my review of these Winwell paddles, this, well, this Winwell paddle. I actually really like it, I think it's great. I don't know whether really you can see that, but it is waxing up, there's wax going on it. Right, so let's just try that in comparison to the one that hasn't been done. Okay, I think it's fair to say there's not a huge amount of difference there. Can you see which one's been waxed? This one is dripping less than this one. This one's still dripping after you pull it out. Let's do that again, let me show you what I mean. So the right hand one, this one, this one does drip and hold a lot more water than this one. So I think maybe with a bit better application that could work. While we're waiting for that to dry, I think what we'll do is we'll try the candle, an ordinary candle, on this Conway paddle. So that we've tried a tea light. Let's just try an ordinary wax tapered candle. With it being flat, this is easier to apply on the blade for sure. Right, let's try these out and see what happens. Certainly looks different underwater. Wow. <laughs> I'm assuming you can tell which is which. This one's the waxed one, it's holding a lot less water, it's just beading off. This one's the unwaxed one. And I think you can see it's, yeah, there. if I show you that way, it still looks wet. That just looks white from the wax. Let's do that one more time. A lot more dripping off on this one. Okay, so that candle work seems to have worked. Right, now for the other test. This is the unwaxed Winnowell paddle, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to try a little bit of WD-40. Now, by my estimation, shouldn't need much of this. Quick squirt, and obviously it is liquid, so it just needs rubbing in.
and this is much less visible than the wax on the board. The concern here obviously would be if you were to do this all the time it would create oil in the water. Now if this works, that's certainly applied a lot quicker than the candle. Right, now these are easy to tell apart in terms of colour. So this one has had the WD-40 on, this one is the only paddle to have had nothing on so far. I think it's quite pleasing to see that the WD-40 <laughs> has made absolutely no difference whatsoever. <laughs> if anything, it seems to be dripping more, but that could be just because it's a bigger paddle. Does it look... No, it looks like it's made absolutely no difference whatsoever. Let's just do this candle waxed paddle again. It does run off a lot better. So yeah, actually, I'm gonna give that a go. I'll let you know whether it works. Thanks for watching this little test. What do you think, have you tried this? For my money, this one seemed to fare better than the tea light. And if you've only got sort of like candles in the house or tea lights, it's better than nothing. I'm gonna apply this to all my paddles and see how they get on. And I'll let you know in future videos. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. Hope you found it useful. If you've liked it, give the video a, a thumbs up. If you don't like it, give it a thumbs down. It's up to you. If you like what I'm doing on this channel, by all means subscribe. It costs you nothing, it just means YouTube give you a notification whenever I upload something new. And there's always a lot of that going on. So I'll see you soon anyway. You take care. Cheerio. This is the unwaxed Winnerwell pot. Uh, <laughs> so in one way to find out, right? So there's that, and then I also thought, in an emergency situation, <laughs> that candle's just fallen in. So I've got a bath full of water here to test this out in. So we'll put that one to one side for the time being, and we'll use this one instead.